Right now, Uptown Dallas, it's a fatal workplace shooting in the Dallas's Uptown. It ended, it ended in a deadly officer-involved shooting about five miles south late this afternoon. Our Sebastian Robertson has been tracking this story since it started. He's now live on the scene with much more for us. Sebastian? Hi, hi, John. A lot of new information. This is um, where that manhunt ended. This is where police opened fire, and we now know that they hit and killed 29-year-old Marlon Smith. They say he was armed, and they believe he's the man that walked into a leasing office in downtown Dallas, his former employer, shooting and killing the woman who used to be his manager. This was the scene shortly after this encounter, late this afternoon. You can see uh, this woman uh, just off Bonnie View Road. She's so upset by what happened. You can see two Dallas officers are helping her walk. This all started about six hours ago. Police say that a security guard worked at the North End apartment complex, was fired, told not to come back. But at 10.15 this morning, he came back killed his former manager and just moments ago we heard an update from Dallas Police Chief Renee Hall. She gives us a little more insight into the moments that led up to the shooting. When they encountered the individual, he exited the vehicle, produced a handgun. Uh, there was an exchange of gunfire. One of the officer's vehicles was struck. Now, we spoke to several residents of the North End apartment complex. One man tells me he was warned by the current security guard to call police if he were to see that fired employee come back to work. And unfortunately, that is uh, what happened this morning. That disgruntled employee came back to his workplace and ended up killing his manager. We know that the manager is a woman in her 50s, and by all accounts, she was very well liked by the residents that we spoke to. In Southern Dallas, Sebastian Robertson, Channel 8 News. Very